Hey everybody, it's Nagel925 and welcome back to some more Let's Play Pikmin. In the last episode, we, we returned to the Forest of Hope and got two ship parts and fought a mini boss and got kind of done with the second mini boss, but we couldn't quite get it in time. So, in this episode, we're gonna get the final ship part in the Forest of Hope and sprout tons of blue Pikmin. So, today we're gonna get out. 60 reds, uh, yeah, 60 reds, and I think we're gonna take out just in, just 10 more than we need, 40 blues, I think, <clears throat> uh, yeah, 40 blues, you know, right at the, the beginning of this area, like, right at the beginning, the graphics look great, <clears throat> okay, so, First things first, we're gonna kill this spotty bulborb because <clears throat> it'll actually pre prevent ship parts from being car carried back. So let's just kill him right now. Yeah. <clears throat> In the distant spring, which is the final area of the game, there are actually spotty bull bears. They are harder types of spotty bull bulborbs. So they're not like super hard, but. They're harder to they're harder to kill, so I will have deaths from them. But you know, I I sh I wouldn't worry about about them. Just if you don't know how to swarm, like my outtakes in day two, then you would then you should be worried. But if you know how to swarm, then you shouldn't be worried. And just so you know, I think in Pikmin two you can like use the uh, D pad left and right to change uh, which Pikmin you want to throw. But in this game, you can't really do that. You have to turn around and use the C stick, which is a lot harder, and it's easier to to, ju to just disband <clears throat> than to do that. So that's the only thing about this game that I don't like. That Pikmin 2, I do like. Okay, th this is the armor cannon beetle. Crap. Oh crap. <clears throat> <clears throat> Like, throw Pikmin into his nose right there, then when his back opens up, throw his Pikmin, throw the Pikmin on here. Even though it seems to be burning, all Pikmin types can, um, kill him. Now, <clears throat> what I didn't know, like, cause I, 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 I watched how to fight this boss, like, right before I'm recording right now, so, I just re, I just realized that, little by little, he recovers health. Which is not very good, all oh, you red. Oh, he's alive! He's alive! Okay, his back has opened up. Let's kill him. Now, I am definitely the worst arm. I'm. I suck at this boss. I mean, look at me. Oh, that that was actually a pretty good one. But most people can kill him in two rounds. No, you blue leaf. I've lost seven Pikmin to this guy. You know, I don't really care be- oh, and that's the ship part oh, over there, right there. And I'm gonna kill him right now. Baby, right now, baby, right now, and his record baby, right now, right now. Okay, I do not- Okay, I just reference the spin me right around, baby, right around, but I switched the lyrics there. Red! Oh man, that was a close one. <clears throat> Honestly, guys. Oh, guess what, guys? Um, stop saying guys. Jeez. Okay, he should be dead in this turn. And oh, be before I get to what I was going to say, this guy, if you take him back to your onion, he gives you 50 Pikmin. Yeah, 50. And we're gonna take let our blues take that. We're gonna make our reds because with the power of slavery. Um, get the ship, get the ship part. This is not, you're not gonna, you're not gonna know. Now, if, like, I know that a lot of people are offended it, for me saying, like, with the power of slavery, but I completely understand. Like, I think sla slavery is wrong. I just, Pikmin, you, you have to make that joke. Well, it's not a Slavery is not a joke, but <clears throat> I'm sorry. I'm just sorry, okay? I'll try not to re to reference to reference slavery again. It's just I'm sorry, okay? 
So, if only these red Pikmin would stop being idiots. Okay, now look at the r r very right counter. Like, the Pikmin. We got 50 Pikmin from just that. And luckily, they're all stored into the onions, so we don't have to pick them up. <clears throat> so, because we need a lot of blues for the, for the Distant Spring, because... The Distant Spring, your main Pikmin will be blues, because most of what it is is water. I'm trying to save some time to talk here by pausing, so if, if you don't mind. So, we need a lot of blues, and only having 46 formally, that is not good. I mean, most people have over 150 right now, and watch this. You can actually see it on the ship, so that's pretty awesome. That's the radiation canopy. 19 ship parts out of 30. We have 11 more we have 11 more to go. Oh, we do have a few. Oh yeah, because we lost 8, so yeah. So <clears throat> so we do need a lot of blue pikmin here. So what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. The distant spring has a lot of ship parts, 10 I think. Uh but you know, I'm not gonna try to push my luck here. I am actually going to <clears throat> now. I'm the rest of the day is just going is just going to be sprouting blue and red Pikmin. So yeah, but if you want to hear what, what what I'm gonna say, then stay tuned. So the distant spring has a lot of ship parts, and you know, if I wanted to push myself really hard and be like Slim Kirby. Then I will be overwhelmed, and if I do, if I get three ship parts instead of four, I will reset. So what I'm going to do is, I will, if I only get one ship part that day, I'll be fine with that. Honestly, if I get at least one ship part a day, I'll get the um, Distant Spring done in ten days. And starting on day 11, I'll start, so at day 21, I'll be doing the final trial. And I, if you don't want to, if if you don't want me to spoil anything, then turn your volume off right now for the next 20 seconds. <clears throat> okay, okay, guys. After you get the, all the parts in the distant spring and everywhere else, there is one more ship part, and that's where the final boss is. So that's what the spoilers is. So if anyone, okay, now. If anyone has turned on their their volume up right now, then it's safe for you because I al I already said what was going to spoil. Okay, so um, the distant spring, yeah. So uh, honestly, if I get two parts a day, which I'll probably be able to complete, I'll get it done in five days. Some days I'll even get three, maybe. Like I I don't know, but yeah. So right now we have got we have over 300 Pikmin to oh 314 Pikmin total. So yeah. So I'm sorry if I did spoil the ending for you guys, but you know I am sorry. So I hope that the people who have who have not seen the ending forgives me. And oh my gosh, you know what? I don't care. Bum rush, bum rush. Yeah, this is ah crud. Oh man, oh man, oh okay. Okay. By the way, if you want to grind Pikmin by killing burrowing snagrits, that is the worst idea ever. Okay? I'm sorry, but that's the worst idea ever. Okay, now we're gonna kill this dude. So I'm basically preparing myself for bull bears. I can kill bull borbs that easy. And bull bears will just be harder. You might have heard a car there, because I live in the suburbs, so... It's not like... So yeah, I don't live in the big city. I don't like city stuff. It's just, like, so boring and just, like... No, I don't want you to carry that with the blues! No! You know what? No, no. Everyone, no. You just stop. Red, no. Come here, come here. Everyone, hug the wall. Hug it like it's your mama. Okay, blues, you take this one. Thank you. And reds. Okay, one blue, fine. Reds, you take you take this one. Now, for some reason, my I might be losing my voice here. Like during this LP, I might be, be losing my voice. If I am, then I'm sorry. 
but yeah. So let's admit a C. Uh, let's see. Let's get this guy and the bull board fine. And whoa, where did all these red Pikmin come from? Wait, wait, what? Did they? Did they stop carrying it? You're grounded. Wait. Oh. You're grounded. I'm gonna make you carry it anyway. You're grounded. The rest of your life. Actually, no, that's kind of harsh, because I still need you. When you're useless, I might kill you, but actually, no. I won't kill you. So, yeah. Oh. Is my brother home? Ah, oh, great. Uh... Ethan, be quiet, I'm doing commentary. Okay. Okay, cool, but be quiet, okay? And I'll open it when I'm done recording, okay? Sorry about that. My bro my brother just got a Lego Ninjago set, which is actually pretty cool. And since today is a Wednesday, man, that's a lot of- Oh, Bulbor! Oh. That is a lot of flowers. Anyway, my brother just got a Lego Ninjago toy. And in fact, it's a Wednesday, so tonight will be a new Ninjago. They're they're going to reveal the green ninja, who by the way is Lloyd Garmadon. Yeah, I don't know why, but apparently I think I think it's because Zane is a robot, so he cannot be the green ninja if he's a robot. And okay. <clears throat> so guys, we have in to in total 153 reds. <clears throat> uh and 158 blues that is great i think the yellows deserve a bit of love here we're gonna we're gonna take out 10 yellows and we might sprout a few yellows even though they are the least useful type of pikmin we will give them a few pikmin to work with here <clears throat> so okay uh, so the ye since the yellows are the least you useful we only need around 50 60 yellows for the entire game because for the final boss we do need yellows for bomb rocks but that's pretty much it <clears throat> so we're gonna take some of these pellets back we're gonna wait for it to turn yellow yes yeah so if you want like blues like if you're and just so you know if oh i forgot Alexander Graydon T TV. I told him that I'd mention his channel on this episode. I'm not going to for forget it now. <clears throat> so, Al Alexander Graydon TV makes these like shows like Julian Smith. Even though Julian Smith is way better, no offense, he's still pretty good. Whoa, what did I do? Whoa, cool. So, um, <clears throat> he makes these things called the the Comedy Bomb and all this stuff. So. I would subscribe to him if I were you. I think I'm subbed. I subbed him a long time ago. So, yeah. So, I think I have a blue in the Armored Cannon Beetle Arena over here. Oh, and all, all, all of them can walk in water, just so you know. Um, <clears throat> yeah, there's one lone blue here. So... You may hear a tiny bit of background noise. I'm gonna hold this blue. Hold down A to hold the blue. Um, our day is almost over, guys. So, uh, yeah. You know what? I'm just going to skip to where it's sunset, okay? So, yeah. So, see you guys then. I'm -a gonna kill us some Wallywogs! Actually, I'm gonna skip some of the... I'm gonna skip some of this, but this I gotta put in here. Yeah! Come on. They are really fast. These are baby Wallywogs. Die! Oh, okay then. So now it's sunset. Now, all, all I really did is put my Pikmin back, and that's pretty much it. So, just so you know, <clears throat> you didn't miss anything much. So, uh, that's pretty much it for this day, actually. I actually saved a minute, because... It the rest of the day is just boring because 
Oh, and just if you are wondering, I do live commentary. If you, if you were wondering, I do live. And the Force of Hope is complete. <clears throat> now, ten days since impact. Hope has begun to well up within me through drop and repair in my own chances. Okay, we sprouted 145 and lost nine. So, guys, with the impact site, the Force Naval, and the Forest of Hope 100% completed, all that is left is the Distant Spring and the final boss. <clears throat> so, in the next episode of Let's Play Pikmin, we're going to go to the, the Distant Spring and see what's going on there. The final area. The final countdown! The final countdown! See you guys then.